this is just absolutely breathtaking. Look at that. New version of a jungle gym type of thing. But this, this is so cool. This is a, a new age kind of globe merry-go-round. That is so cool. Look at this place. It, it, oh, this is just spectacular. Corner of Oak Knoll and Union behind Colorado. One block north of Colorado. Hey folks, how you doing? Welcome back. It's Charlie. It is Sunday morning. Yay! <laughs> Oh my goodness, I think it is almost 10 o'clock. It's uh, Sunday, September 18th, 2022. Uh, it's about 69, almost quickly approaching 70 degrees. Uh, another kind of an in-between day. Some parts a little bit warmer, hotter. Uh, but we are expected to uh, get a little bit higher up in temp. I don't think we're going to near anything like we had in the past but we'll see it's very unpredictable i am today of course in pasadena it is sunday morning my wonderful little respite i got my cup of champurrado uh, champurrado is a, a latin drink mexican drink it's kind of, it's a oatmeal uh based drink oatmeal starch based right there it's really good like a very thick hot chocolate but anyway uh, this is part of uh, with all the housing the new developments and everything and if you can see behind me let's swing that around with all the new housing and stuff that they have built here and still continuing I, I believe with about another two more projects over in that area with one still in the works well two more still in the works up by uh, the Centennial or Centennial Square but the trio that's about 10 maybe 8 about 10 that one's maybe almost 15 I believe but they have built certainly a lot of tight tightly packed residential units very much so. I mean they're nice some are nicer than the others some are not too great there's still some more going over there. And then of course, over on Walnut, we have several housing projects. But out of all that, uh, I'm pretty sure that by law, but also by civil practices, you do need to have a respite uh, in certain areas. Needing demand, well, for, for a respite. And this is the, the newest one. This is the very, very beautiful new park. It was slated to be, had a grand opening uh, about, uh, I think two weeks ago, maybe about a week ago, thereabouts, but we had that incumbent storm come in and uh, just kind of put, put a muck on everything. And uh, this, this also has a, this park is also has a special meaning because it's also dedicated to uh, a local favorite, local celebrity and a local resident. <clears throat> But uh, they just, this park is, it's beautiful. I mean, it has a place for the, for the kitties, as you see. And uh, all the modern toy, they never had anything like that when I was a kid. We had the old 400 story tall rocket, remember that? That was made out of galvanized steel. With the metal, metal slides that you attempted to try to slide down during the summertime uh, your skin would turn into third degree blisters and just stick you there but look at this it's great you can bring your dog have a little little picnic a little respite and there are some facilities here uh, water fountains this used to be actually uh, I believe a huge parking lot and then they turned this over
the newest ones here. There's a very, very new one. You know, it's kind of deceiving architectural wise. I'm not at all really, with the exception of maybe this one, um, architecturally, it's eh. But again, we're going into that transition of being bland, almost monotone, black and white, and usually maybe a light desert and black. But uh, it's, it's not as earthy tone as it used to be. I kind of like that even, you know, this is the trio. But I know that from uh, looking, going to the websites and everything, and you look and you see the presentation or some have uh, the virtual tours, uh, most of these places, uh, they better for what you're paying and for what little size you're getting on the inside, have a nice courtyard. Many nowadays, many without a pool. Especially here in California, that just, if there's a pool added, I have to say if a place has a swimming pool, an apartment or a living uh, situation has a pool in it. Probably expect to pay in maybe an extra two to three hundred dollars or more, depending too. You know, so um, with the cost and the drought and everything, as dire as it is, as they say, it's it, it's pretty expensive. It, it really is. So here, you know, as as I was filming and looking at this. I'm kind of thinking the way it's low cut, because it could be higher cut, but I'm also thinking, you know, maybe it's the dogs. I don't know, but it's cute. Here is the parking. Yeah, this whole area, this whole little pie-shaped lot used to be a parking lot, public parking lot. You know how many cities have that feature and there's with people just kind of like doing the ride share and everything now and especially here in California um, owning a car is just defeating your 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 income it seems like hmm shaking my head so whereas all this used to have vehicles this is the amount that's left plus there are charging stations for you families uh, with EVs, especially local, you know, especially on the weekends and everything. And here looks like the the doggy paddock area. <clears throat> Most of our parks are dog friendly, but more and more, a lot of the new parks that they're building, they are including special doggy areas, which is very cool. There's two. Looks like there's two separate areas. So yeah, see, and it's it's labeled small dogs and larger dogs, poopy bags. There's one of the queen's doggies. There's a queen's dog. And here's the uh, exchange gate. Or if you're back from the Midwest, this would be like the mud room. See, very cool. And this is for the maybe larger dogs. But we do have a really cool one over by Hastings Ranch. A big one. Yeah, large, large dogs. It's very hot. I am really just such a spectacular job here. And it's not too big. It's not lavish. It's just... It's right, it's just, see, they got a tricky fountain and a water, looks like a, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. To fill your water bottles and a place for the, for the pets. And here's the back side. But, but, and there's the facilities. There's some freshly fresh, but, but, this, this is the park's stage, the public stage, so they're going to plan on doing things here. So this is a really nice little area here. 
uh, to perform and, and do stuff. I'm not sure exactly what uh, permissions are going to be like. I'm sure you're going to have to check with the with the city on the website and everything. But this this here also has a double meaning, this park. Because it's also not just dedicated to the community, but it's also dedicated to another family that used to live here. Very, very special family. It's very nice, right? There is, I believe, I'm not sure if it already has been done. I don't think it has, but there is a statue or a bust that is slated to be in the com commemoration of Edward Van Halen. So this is uh, our newest park. They did a great job overall. Very beautiful. Now I'm seriously green with envy with some of these little things that they have for these kids. <laughs> and have those. All right. That's a little bit of my Sunday morning that I'm sharing with you folks. Oh, and there's bike, bike racks here too. And then if you go up behind me, and then that direction, you'll run into uh, Lucky Boy Burgers and have breakfast, or have breakfast first. French toast, may I, may I recommend the French toast uh, for the missus and the kids? Pancakes too, and uh, for the gentleman, the breakfast burrito. If you can power chow that thing down, your races. Whew. Time to get some errands done and see if there's going to be any peace in the house. You folks take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but always take care of yourselves first. Love one another, trust one another, be kind to each other, help one another. Don't take it for granted or any other day thereafter. Live for the moment. Pull down your pants and slide on that ice. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. If you like what I'm doing, what we're doing, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification button. Tell your friend, friends and family about me, about us, what's going on. And uh, our newest park. Beautiful. Playhouse Village Park. I will put the links down below. Again, please. <laughs> If there is no link down below, bleep, 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 please mention something in the comments. Charlie, you forgot. Because with everything that's going on, the old noodle is either getting fried or just old age. I love you all. Stay safe. Be smart. And be very kind.